Okay, so this just happened. So <laughs> this popcorn bag just did this to my shirt. Luckily, I know how to solve that. So let's go home and fix this problem. All right, so here is my good old stained shirt now. So yeah, leave it to me to not just get one stain, but to get two <laughs> butter stains out of all things on my shirt. Here's the big one right there. Luckily, I do know how to solve this. This has happened to me before, and the solution is seventh generation stain remover. I'm just going to spray this thing on, on all the spots where I know there is a stain, and clearly my stains are very obvious. So I'm just going to drench that really well with the spray bottle and literally just soaking it. Um, normally, I think it says to let it sit for about 24 hours or you could wash immediately, but I'm just going to spray it on, which is my biggest concern right now, just to make sure that most of it will go away later. But this is the bottle company that makes it seventh generation. I got mine at Target. I think they also sell it at Walmart. So you could get it there for five to six bucks. And here is the second stain on my pants also. Also more butter. I blame Alan for jinxing me saying that all that butter was going to end up on my clothes and he was right. Now I'm just going to spray this up too and get that all situated. I'm just going to let it sit overnight really and I will wash it in the morning and take care of that later. Alright so it is the next morning. I'm just going to turn on this washing machine and get it ready for washing. I'm going to get my detergent ready, of course pour in the right amount that I want to use, open this up, throw in that detergent in there and close it back up so that the suds could collect and that way the soap distributes evenly. Might anyone that does that? Anyways, then I'm going to throw in these clothes like so, close that back up and don't worry I did go ahead and add more clothes to this, that was just visually pleasing to watch only two items go in. But open that up once it's done. Take out these two shirts, well the shirt and the pants, see what they look like. In case you guys don't have a dryer, I don't think the dryer makes much of a difference anyway. But here's what it looks like when it's still wet after washing. And honestly, I don't see any of it to be honest. Let me know if you do, but I don't. Throw that into the dryer, set it up, and let's go ahead and get this ready to dry and see what it ends up looking like. guys here is the finishing product so as you see it was around this area around here I don't know if you could see it but it's like the most minimum man you can't even really notice it oh right here it's the most minimum thing ever but I tell you like the camera picks up on it way more than you actually can in person I wish wish you guys were here so you can actually see it but Right there I could see it on camera, but when I look at it in person, really it's the most faint thing ever. But compared to how it was and knowing that most stains are like really obnoxious and leaves like the dark color, it is it turns out really good in my opinion. I don't know if you can see. See like the camera picks up on it way more like when it's like this. But when I do this, this is more realistic to how it shows up in person. See how the color kind of it all looks the same it's just like the shading of my hand yeah so i think that came out really really good and the one that was over here on the side is completely gone so i think it just all depends on how early you catch it and that was a boatload of butter that was like some serious i put mad butter on that popcorn in the movie theaters and then here are the pants the pants theirs is completely gone there's nothing left there so those came out awesome that was a good save on that that was really good and then here's two more like I said I had gotten these shirts when I was pregnant with Luna and when I tell you I stained all of them they were all stained and and this one Actually, I had washed it. I had sprayed it like I had already washed it about four times even with the stain um, being there. I still hadn't learned about this product. I still hadn't even learned about it. And I finally got it after like I had already washed these about four times this shirt. And I sprayed it on just for like 
just for poops and giggles and it worked it got most of it off again like i don't even know where it used to be and this one was much darker stains and again i said i had gotten like three of them and this one had really bad stains too and this one also gone why did only my new shirts get stained i don't know maybe i got too brave they're all gone though but i'm really happy with how this turned out again like see like now i don't see it i think it's just the camera angle sometimes it catches it over here Sometimes it catches it on the camera angle, but I promise you in person you can't see it. But yeah, compared to how it was, I'll probably do one more go around because it was such strong butter. And I'll do this one more time and I'm sure it'll help a lot. So yeah guys, but this is the best thing I've definitely found so far and it's completely plant-based, it's natural. And yeah, 7th generation makes it, it's just a laundry stain remover and it does take out some tough stains because some popcorn butter, that's... That's a, that's a lot of butter, and that stuff's like really concentrated in my opinion, but it works. It's really good. I still have a boatload of it left. I think I got this at Target for 5 to $6, so I think it's definitely worth it, and I'd still definitely, definitely recommend it. Like I said, I'll probably do it one more time, but even how it turned out, like I said, in person, you can't see it. Huh. But yeah, guys, I hope you really, really like this video. Uh, if you haven't seen my kitchen stain remover or oil remover for the kitchen, go ahead and check that out. I ended up finding this product because of that product. I'm like, wait a second. If I could remove stains in my kitchen, I'm pretty sure I could find things for my laundry. So I'll put that link up on the top so you guys could check it out. It's a really good video in my opinion, and it works amazingly. But yeah, guys, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget we upload every Tuesday and Thursday at 3 p.m., with bonus videos, don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe down below if you're not already. And yeah guys, don't forget to stay happy, stay safe, and enjoy the rest of your day because after all it's no one else's and it's uniquely yours. Bye guys.